Hey everyone, it's Andrew Cartwright here, and it's time to get started. Happy Motivational Monday. Hopefully you're having a fabulous day. Here's your daily stimulus check, second stimulus check, third stimulus check, fourth stimulus check. For some people, yes, it's their fifth. Executive action, executive order, and stimulus package update for Monday, May 24th, 2021. Almost half the year is gone. Can you believe that? Find out how more than 1.2 million stimulus checks have still not been sent. Amazing news on what people are not doing with their stimulus check. Which company is offering you free stimulus bonuses for getting vaccinated? Really? And amazing news from one state that's asking their residents how they want to see their vital stimulus funds dispersed. Like, how would you like it? How would you like your money after this? For the best news and information to master, dominate, and elevate your money, business, and life, stay tuned to this channel. Also, it pays to actually like, subscribe, and comment. How? All you gotta do is subscribe, like, and comment. You might lose some weight as well, I'm just saying. You'll burn some calories. But when we hit 190,000 subscribers, I'm launching $1,900 cash to a random comment. So you can, you can say anything you want in the comments. That's your protected space to say whatever you like, it can be just random comment. Some people have won with that. Also, grab your Weeble stock down below. Two stocks for free, valued up to $1,850. It is amazing. It is a limited time offer. Tons of people are getting these stocks, and it is amazing. Like, out of nowhere, you just open up an account, and you could get $1,900 in cash. Also, limited time offer, my real estate program, $4,000 course. Literally spent $45 million making mistakes. It'll tell you what to buy, different asset classes. Do you want commercial, residential? Do you want retail? What do you want? And market cycles, when to buy it. And also, where to get the money. Like who, who do you call to get the money and how do you break down the loan? How much do you have to put in it? 36 videos, a master's course in real estate from a master that has flipped, built, commercial subdivisions, hundreds of houses. Anyway, make sure you check it out. But first, more than 1.2 million stimulus checks from the first, oh, by the way, the best stuff I always save to the last story. So if you don't watch all the way to the end, you miss the best stuff, just saying. But first, more than 1.2 million stimulus checks from the first round of disaster relief funds still have not been spent due to a number of different reasons. We're gonna break them down here. The IRS explained that California leads the country with 123,265 unsent stimulus checks. Kind of spooky that they know the exact number, right? Florida is in second with 92,018, and Texas, New York, and Pennsylvania round off the top five that have not cashed their check. The IRS also stated that these $1.2 million stimulus checks include, and the quote, the number of people who either refused to accept it, can you imagine? No, I'm not taking it. You can't force me to take money from the government. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, pay back or not cash the stimulus checks they received from the IRS as a result of the CARES Act that was signed into law on March 27, 2021. Interesting, right? They didn't cash it. They don't want to cash it, all kinds of different reasons, or just didn't get it. Hopefully, these millions of Americans can finally claim their $1,200 stimulus check for over a year ago, as I'm sure there are all a lot of great people out there that still are struggling financially. For those people who are refusing it, just accept it and give it to little Jimmy or little Sarah. Put it in their college fund. I'm just saying. Meanwhile, the folks over at United Airlines have announced a new stimulus initiative that could provide you with two round trip flights to anywhere in the world if you can uh, be fully vaccinated. So if you get vaccinated, you get the shot, you could go and you could bring your loved one with you. United explained in a statement, quote, as a part of, quote, your shot to fly. Sounds like, hmm, interesting. Sweepstakes, members who upload vaccine records to United Mobile app or website through, Jan through June 22nd are eligible to win a round trip flight for two passengers to anywhere in the United, that United flies. United CEO Scott Kirby states, quote, thanks to the vaccine, more and more 
uh, destinations are opening up for travel and we know our customers are eager to fly. We're excited to give people one more reason to get vaccinated so they can reunite with their friends and their family or take a long awaited vacation, end quote. I wonder how that works with HIPAA law. When you have companies and you're like, I don't want your health information because I don't want to be a part of the HIPAA laws, which you have to protect people's medical information. And now you've got medical information you're uploading. I'm just saying, I always think from a business model standpoint, because I own 13 companies and I started 32 companies in 17 industries, I probably would never ask you for any medical information of yours to be given to me. I'm just saying. But hey, it's interesting. This is amazing news, though, for millions of Americans across the country that are hoping to take advantage of the new stimulus programs and take a vacation. I'm sure they deserve after the past 14 months of craziness. And you're like, man, that's a real bummer conversation from Andrew. I'm not used to that. I'm just, you know, you, I just, I just want to make sure everybody's happy and like doing the right thing. And finally. The great state of Colorado is looking to guide the federal stimulus spending over the next 10 years, 10 years, and is seeking input from residents on how their vital disaster relief funds should be spent. They're asking for input. So we got 10 years to give you money, how you want it. City leader in Denver have announced a new stimulus initiative to give residents an opportunity to provide feedbacks on stimulus investment centers around the community, business, and infrastructure. Now, Kirky Turner, uh, the Denver's finance department spokesman, explained, quote, it is critical for us to have residents at the table when we're deciding on how we should prioritize investments and specific resources that are going to make the most impact for people who are hit the hardest by the pandemic, end quote. This is amazing. Finally, leaders going, hey, what you want? If we're for the people, by the people, of the people, why not ask the people? Thanks to the American Rescue Plan, Colorado is due to receive upward of $308 million over the next two years. And it's great to see that the state is seeking input for citizens on how they would like to see their stimulus funds spent. They, uh, what would you like your state to do in the influx of stimulus funds already hitting penny banks around the country in our government's possession. Let me know kind of comments below what your clever idea. My thing is, and I've always had this idea, universities, nonprofits, churches, they're always asking for money, right? Because I've contributed to lots of organizations. And I'm like, why don't you take and invest the money, get a 10% return, and then that's one tenth of the people you have to ask money from. And then as that grows, at some point, your organization is self-contained. What are you doing? I mean, what, what are you doing? Like big invest, big company, big places like Harvard have an incredible endowment fund. They make so much money. Take this money, invest it, use the invested money, and you'll feed your community for a lifetime. This is a limited time place where we're gonna get this much money. $300 million could probably earn $30 million a year for the entire lifeline and be able to spend it for the people if they invested it properly. So I just don't get it. And they're gonna spend it and it's gonna be gone. And we're gonna be in the same hole because they don't think that way. Crazy people like me think that way. That was your stimulus check, second stimulus check, and executive action and stimulus package update for Friday, May 21st, 2021. What do you think about that? Put it in the comments below. Do you think that they should invest that and have $30 million for the next hundreds of years or spend it all and it's gone? Thank you for watching. Please leave a comment with your favorite time of the year. What do you like the best? I like this time of year in Las Vegas, Nevada because the weather is perfect. It's great for running, swimming, hiking, it's absolutely gets a little hot. And then we're back to this weather again, which is fantastic and it never really gets that cold. I'm not trying to sell you on Nevada, but it's pretty, pretty awesome place to live. Take care, I love you.